So, uh, next thing I'm going to show you is are, are my 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 boots. These are boots that they use in the military. As you can see, it's made by the same people that make my BDU. And these boots, uh, they're steel toe boots. As you can tell, that's great that they're steel toe boots because that way you can like kick somebody in the nuts and it'll hurt a lot. Yeah, we're, we're allowed to do that at our, at our airsoft games. So, uh, next up is my helmet. Um, this is the M1 helmet. It's the helmet that the U.S. Army used in, in Vietnam. Um, this, this helmet's made out of metal as well. This is my, like, you know, steel toe boots. I like that because it, like, makes me think that I'm in the, the, the real army. So, last but not least, um, I've got the goggles. The, the goggles are, are very important to have when playing airsoft. I know this because I saw a movie. The movie was called The Christmas Story. Um, some kid, Ralphie, um, he shot a BB gun off and it ricocheted and hit him in the, the eye because he was being a dumbass and everything. Um, but thankfully he was wearing glasses, but he should have been wearing these airsoft glasses instead. Just, just normal glasses. I've also got uh, this thing over here. Uh, like. Um. Uh. Okay. Yeah, it's just that I. I don't really like, I don't really get this, like this thing's like, it's a little too heavy, uh, and, like, I, I just, it's just, I don't know, it's too, like my, a, like my ACOG scope doesn't like fit on it or anything, and I only have like one magazine that I can fit it. My friend gave it to me, he insisted that I use it, but, I think he's just jealous that I have my own GNG combat machine and that this thing's not as good. So that way, um, he, he'll be able to, like, to beat me at airsoft. But I don't want that to happen. I also got this friggin' thing over here. <coughs> got this for my birthday uh the, the fps isn't as good on this gun plus it, like it, it uses gas and i like using co2 you know because you get more fps out of that like i really i really don't know what i'm supposed to do with it like uh i don't know what just happened there I think this is the safety right here. Uh, I'm not. I'm not too sure. So yeah, this this isn't really like in my taste or anything like that. The transformers will return after these messages. The following presentation is brought to you by Popeye Tasty Candy Sticks. Really cool because they're tasty and they look like a pack of doobies at the same time.
now return to the Transformers. So now I'm gonna show you like what I look like with all my gear on. So uh yeah. This is uh what I look like with all my gear on and stuff. Uh what I really like about my gear is that people tend to like think I'm like I'm an action movie hero like Arnold Schwarzenegger, Sylvester Stallone, uh, Red Brown. So I'm about to show you some footage of me in action. Uh, yeah, uh, that's me right there, the big guy, the big guy, yeah. Yeah, there's me. There's my combat machine. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just getting some kills right here. Yeah, this this is a pretty fun game. Uh, if this was filmed by uh, Scout the Doggy, uh, and I I was playing at Section Eight Airsoft, I recommend that you go there. Uh, there's one other thing I want to show you over here. Uh, this is Godzilla. Uh, he's the one who like protects all my airsoft guns and gear from from people like Gary Busey, who's always trying to steal all my airsoft gear and stuff so he can beat me in airsoft. But all thanks to Godzilla, that doesn't happen. This over here is my L96. 